busy with this fella. Twenty-one-one SO. I'm gonna be out south one eighteen. I stopped you. You're speeding 85 and a 70. I just am so sorry. I was so sure when they came back with a not guilty verdict, my stomach just hit the bottom. Go down here, just sightseeing. No, I actually just got a job at Alpine and I helped them move up here. <laughs> I'll be right back. Okay. During the trial, it just didn't add up. I recall that Tony had blacked out. And then in the court, I saw where he all of a sudden could remember. Well, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to warn you, all right? Yeah, I'm going to put my cruise control. That a girl. Me. You'll see a lot more of the country, and you'll enjoy it more, OK? You cannot know how faithful I am for not giving me a ticket. I have a 15-mile-an-hour rule, and I hope nobody hears me say that. <laughs> Thank you. After we heard he was going to plead self-defense, when we saw his attorney, he said he couldn't argue that he wasn't there. So they got to have something. Well, they got to have some excuse, you know. You know, you got to understand how people feel. It's human nature to make up the excuse. And sometimes that puts you in a bad situation. This lady a while ago, she told me that, man, I ain't got no reason. I'm just hauling ass. You know, when you get an honest person that tells you what's going on, you know what I mean? You, that's, that goes a long ways, the honesty does.